Hello, and welcome to the fourth episode of Algebra. Today, we're going to talk about decimals and percentages and how they relate to fractions. So in episode three, we learned about fractions and how we added and subtracted them. But in this episode, we're going to learn that fractions actually have counterparts to them, and those counterparts are decimals and percentages. All of these things are actually one and the same. They're just writing the same quantity in a different way. So for instance, we have the fraction one half here. And if we were gonna write it as a decimal, we would have to divide that fraction. So let's do that. Let's put one in the division symbol. And let's put two on the outside. And if we actually divide one by two, we would get 0.5. Now 0.5 is just the decimal version of one half. Those things are equal to each other, right? So fractions and decimals are one and the same, just written in a different way. Now a percentage is then taking that decimal, 0.5, and multiplying it by 100. If you multiply a decimal by 100, you can turn it into a percentage. In this case, it would be 50%. So as you can see here, fractions, decimals, and percents are all one in the same. You can take a percent and turn it into a fraction. You can take a fraction and turn it into a percent. You can turn a fraction into a decimal and vice versa. Right? They're all one in the same. I feel like a lot of students get confused because they think of each one of these things as separate things, but they are not. Fractions, decimals and percents all represent the same value. That's all I wanted to say for this video. I wanted to make sure this is clear moving forward. Before, though, we leave, let's just do one more example. We're going to turn a percent into a fraction just so you can see how it's done, and then we'll sign off for this episode. So let's take a different percent We'll do 30%. Keep it simple. Okay, so 30% needs to be turned into a decimal. So to turn a decimal into a percent, we multiplied by 100. So to make it not a, a percent anymore, turn it back into a decimal, we're going to divide. 30 divided by 100. And when we do that, we're going to get 0.3. So that's our fraction. 30% is 0.3. And now if we wanted to make that into a fraction, okay, we would just need to put 0.3 over 1. 0.3 over 1, well, you could imagine then if you multiplied 0.3 times 10, you would get 3. And if you multiplied 1 times 10, you'd get 10. And you'd end up with 3 tenths. So the percentage is 30%. The decimal is 0.3, and the fraction is 3 tenths. So whenever you're doing math, just remember that all three of these things are one and the same, and they're interchangeable. And you can change between them with some simple multiplying and dividing. Thanks for watching. See you in the next episode.